Well, staying in Xinjiang, where ethnic, culture, and religious freedoms are under government protection, back in May, our reporter Xu Daoqin visited the Xinjiang Islamic College, the only one of its kind in the area. Nearly a thousand students have graduated from that institution and gone on to become Muslim clerics since it was first founded 20 years ago. We spoke to a couple of young men who study and live there. Once the call for prayer resounds over campus, all the students gather at the mosque. They do this five times a day. Vice President and Mullah of the college, Abdurraqib Tubniaz, is seldom absent from prayers, which is the most important lesson for the students. After graduation, they will go back to their hometowns and put the same prayers in mosques there. It's not easy to enroll in the college. Thousands of young men apply every year, but only around 200 are selected. <laughs> Devotion is fundamental for every student. They are not allowed to smoke, drink, or commit any act proscribed by the Quran. Mulan Abdurrakab says, no students have been found breaking the rules. Clerics are the scholars among Muslims. They have to be respected and set an example for others. We hope the students become high-level clergymen with good knowledge and ability so they can work better for our people. Uh, 70% of the lessons are related to Muslim theology. The rest cover Chinese and Arabic language, computer science, history and geography. All the lessons are taught in Uyghur, the local ethnic language. Devotion doesn't mean boredom. The future clergymen all look energetic and active playing football after class. The mullahs are not always very strict with the students either, all the time. Abdul Rekerb is a sports fan. He doesn't look quite as agile as a student, but the youngsters obviously know how to show respect for the vice president. But the goal for these students is very simple. I come from a small town in the countryside. The only thing I want to do is to be a qualified clergyman after graduation. I like new things in the city, but I have to concentrate on studying. The number of graduates from the Islamic College is very small compared to the Muslim population in Xinjiang. But the higher education these future Akhons are receiving will gradually and surely benefit the religious circle in the region. Together with other Islamic schools in the rest of Xinjiang, the college is playing an important role in proving the country's religious situation. Xu Naoqin, CCTV, Wurunqi, Xinjiang.